Hey, what's up, everybody? Here's another water comparison video. Tonight, we're comparing these two waters. First up is Foundations Island Yoga water. Next up is this bottle with no label on it that says nothing about the water on the whole bottle. No branding at all on this water. So before we move on, I have to explain where these came from. So in my last water comparison video, I reviewed Bentley Pittsburgh water, and I mentioned how it was a custom bottle of water with a custom label, and it was a, from a company that does like branding services like that, and they you know give out products like bottles of water. And so because I did that last review, it got me kind of researching companies that do that, and I found two other companies that do that. They sell custom branding bottles of water. And I kind of considered getting a John Drinks Water brand of bottled water. And um, I was just kind of researching it. And I ended up emailing these companies and I said, hey, can you send me a sample? And they both agreed to. And so these are just samples from those custom label companies. And this one didn't come with a sample. They just sent me the bottles just so I can try out the water and see the bottle this one i guess this company sent me an example that they've done for a pre previous customer and i guess foundations island yoga was a previous customer and they just had an extra bottle laying around that they sent me as a sample so this one is from empirepromotions.com and um it has the mouth you know lid on it the suction lid that can be opened and closed. This one is from waterbottles.com, which they must have paid a lot of money for that URL, that domain name. It's just waterbottles.com. I bet they paid millions of dollars for that, or at least hundreds of thousands for that URL. And if you go there, they don't just have bottles with water in them. They also have reusable, recyclable um bottles too that you can have your own custom branding on it and so these are both similar prices like let's say you do an order for about 2,000 custom bottles um with the with this one it would be about 98 cents per bottle for 2,000 of them which seems really high to me even though they're doing custom labels that seems pretty high this one is uh, about 89 cents per bottle if you order 2,000. So I, there was probably taxes and shipping on top of that, I would assume. I'm, the prices weren't that clear, and there's like a discount the more that you order. But I think with taxes and stuff, you're going to end up paying about a dollar per bottle. So if I wanted to order 2,000 of these, I would have to spend $2,000. So I'm probably never going to have um, my own custom bottle. Or if I do, I'll just use a regular bottle and just make my own label for it. Just because that's out of my price range. Um, I was thinking about selling them, but I, I assume at most I'd probably only sell 10 of them and I would end up losing thousands of dollars. So the water bottles bottle. There's a problem with their website. I have an ac I have a accusation about their website. I think that the reviews on their website are fake. If you look at the reviews for this bottle, it says that there are 700, uh, I'm sorry, it says that there are 415 five-star reviews. It says that there are 14 four-star reviews. It says that there are one, three, uh, I'm sorry, it says there are two three-star reviews, and then there are zero two stars and zero one star reviews for this custom water bottle. I find that very hard to believe. I um, sort of wonder if they've removed, um, you know, low, low reviews. Um, I have no proof of this. This is just, just based on that information I just gave you. I have to assume that some of the reviews for this product are kind of fake. With 415 five-star reviews, unless this is like the best water in the world, it's very hard for me to imagine that those are all real. Um, 
sorrywaterbottles.com. Um, I I have no way of proving this. This is just my own like assumption. Um, so don't sue me for slander. But um, anyway, I'm just putting that out there. For the Empire Promos water, there's actually a little bit of information on the bottle. If you look at the side, it actually says where it's from. It's from Northumberland, PA, which sounds familiar to me. I think I reviewed another bottle from that place, from that part of Pennsylvania, but I couldn't figure out which one it was. If have any of you seen like all my water reviews, do you remember a bottle from Northumberland, PA? It says it's bottled by TSW, which is Tulpokin Spring Water. And uh, if you go to their website for Tulpokin Spring Water, they mention doing custom labels. So I guess they just have a partnership with Empire Promotions. The bottle says that it contains 100% spring water and its contents are incredibly pure. Processed by reverse osmosis, micro microcarbon filtration, UV and ozonation so that's what it says about this water this water says nothing <laughs> like i said they didn't include a label and on the website there's like no information about the water itself it, the website just mentions the custom branding stuff so let's open them up and uh do a comparison this one feels it feels like solid on the bottom and then on top it's like it feels kind of thin up here but I guess once they put a label on it, it would be it would be feeling a little thicker. But that's just my initial thoughts. Um, with this one, with the Empire Promotions one, I like that they have the custom lid. It seems like in the '90s, the the uh, the suction lid was a lot more popular. But I think they stopped using it because it uses more plastic to create it, and it's kind of wasteful for a disposable bottle of water. But it has even the protective piece of plastic. And then the lid. You, you guys know, know how this works. Um, so let's taste them out. And um, here we go. It's pretty good. Did I just say taste them out? <laughs> it's kind of a weird way to say it. Um, and no strong, no strong uh, plasticky taste to it. I, I tried the vitamin water water and it had like this strong plasticky taste that I was worried came from the the top lid but this one doesn't have the strong plasticky taste and here is the bottledwater.com water the bottledwater.com water also sells a version with this suction mouth lid on it you have to pay extra per bottle to get that. It's good. These are both, you know, I can't complain. These are both good, uh, good waters. For the Empire Promotions one, they actually sent me two different versions. I guess from, you know, two separate companies that did custom labels. To be honest, I think both of the graphic designers for these bottles. Are pretty bad doesn't that just look like it was just thrown together in a couple minutes or by someone who like doesn't know how to photoshop i mean the, the yoga one's okay but this one just looks pretty bad <laughs> they use like microsoft word or something <laughs> but i mean i guess this is an atv company i guess they're not like a graphic design company so you can't really blame them can't complain i guess so, all right, now I'm going to do the pH test. All right, here's the results of the pH test. That's waterbottles.com on the left and Empire on the right. You can compare the color to that chart down there, decide which pH level you think it is. To me, it looks like about a 6, but I'm colorblind, so what do you guys think it looks like? It looks pretty uh, acidic to me. The websites don't mention a pH level for either of them at all, so it's not that surprising that it's uh, you know, kind of acidic. Alright, there you go. pH level. It's probably been over a year since I've had a bottle with the suction lid on it. I kind of miss them. They're, they're nice. It's like easy to close. This is 
is a good taster. These, these are both good tasting. Thumbs up for both of these. And again, thank you, both of these websites, for sending me, you know, these samples for free. If you guys want a sample, you can probably just email these companies, and they'll probably send you your own sample. The Empire Promotions Company, they actually have, like, tons of other stuff. Um, Empire promos.com if you email them like they have like custom flash drives that you can put your company's logo on you can probably just email their their company and say like hey send me a sample of your flash drives and get like a free flash drive i would guess i mean if they send out the bottle of water so easily i figure or they have like other random you know small objects that you can do customized check them out Email and ask for some stuff. The worst they can do is say no. Um, for this bottle, I kind of like... <laughs> I kind of like it best without the label, to be honest. I like how it's, like, so minimalistic. If you were, like... If I was giving a presentation or something, this would be cool to just have on the, on the podium. Because, like, it's not distracting with any branding or anything. Just simple and minimalist, minimalistic and clean and you know looks good this is tough actually these are both good tasting waters like surprisingly good I had really low expectations pH test was pretty acidic, which is, I guess, most people think it's bad, but the taste, like, the review is based on the taste, they're both tasting pretty good. It has, like, a, you know, a soft texture to it, which seems like a plasticky attribution. But it doesn't have the, the plasticky taste to it. Um, this is tough. I'm going to say that the winner is the... Uh, the... Let me see. I'm going to say Empire Promotions is the winner. Just, just based on the taste being slightly better. Like, it's like a soft... Soft... Uh, taste and texture to it they're, they're both wet waters they're both both getting thumbs up from me and um you know the review has nothing to do with the label <laughs> this is not a review of foundations island yoga or that atv company it's a review of the custom bottle company so congratulations Empire Promos. I think water bottles or waterbottles.com has a much better URL. A lot easier to remember, but Empire Promotions wins because of the taste of the water. So, congratulations, Empire Promotions. You can pretend you're like a hamster. Alright, bye everyone.